Starting with version 12, Proto Twin Connect now supports vectorized gymnasium environments, accelerating the training process with deep reinforcement learning. In this example, we trained a model of the Unitree Go 2 quadruped robot with the goal of performing a handstand. You can see the final result here running in virtual reality using the Meta Quest 3. The process begins by importing the CAD of the robot into Prototwin. At this point, we can start adding behavior to the model. Here we add physics to the limbs and define all the joints and motors. You don't need an existing URDF file or to undertake the laborious process of creating one. Similarly, you don't need to create an XML description of the robot or programmatically create the physics. The process is quick and simple. Just click to select the anchor point and axis for the joints. Once finished, we can test the joints by setting some target positions for the motors. You can adjust the speed, acceleration, and deceleration of the motors at this point if necessary. You can also set the maximum torque that can be applied by the motors to achieve the speed profile. We make a Python package available that includes the base gymnasium environment. You just need to extend this base environment to define your reward function and termination conditions before you can start training. Initially, the robots perform mostly random actions, but they quickly learn to kick their rear legs upwards in order to increase the height of their feet. Within a few minutes, they are starting to be able to balance on their hands. We reward them based on the height of their feet above the ground, and also based on the length of time that they keep their feet in the air. And here is the final result after training for a while. We didn't subject the robots to external forces whilst training, but the trained model seems to be pretty robust anyway. For such a simple reward function, the result is surprisingly good. You can run and interact with the model yourself by visiting our website. The software runs entirely inside your web browser. Thanks for watching.